Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise Master Jesus. The Lord bless each and everyone again joining in the name of Jesus. This amazing prophetic world title seeks, you should get ready, hallelujah. A white bag is about to reach you very soon, which is full of something, praise Master Jesus. Get ready, a white bag is about to reach you as soon as possible. Get ready. This is not a prophetic word for you to screw. Hallelujah, praise Master Jesus. Oh, Father, we give you glory. Father, we give you glory. We thank you in the name of Jesus. Can we just pray together wherever you are watching me? We cannot just receive this amazing word and you are there. Oh my God, just join me in the spirit. I don't know the words that are coming up your mind, but just thank God, Father, my expectations will not be cut short. I know from the title you are expecting to hear something great. Just thank God in 10 seconds, Father, my expectation will not be cut short. We are praying together, my expectation will not be cut short. Father, I pray for each and everyone watching and connecting under the sound of my voice. Let this prophetic word meet them at their point of need. In the name of Jesus. God bless each and every one again joining family in the name of Jesus. The Bible says this is a day that the Lord has made that we should rejoice and be glad. Believe me for a new encounter through this amazing prophetic word in the name of Jesus. I saw a delivery man with a bag. I saw a delivery man with a bag, I mean to say, a delivery man. This delivery man is like is a messenger holding a bag. Praise Master Jesus. And the Lord told me this man that has been sent is, is an angel. One thing I tell people repeatedly when God wants to raise a man, God look for a man that is available. Praise Master Jesus. When God wanted to send to, to save the people of Nini, God sent Jonah. When God wanted to, 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 to oh my God, to speak to King, King Ezekiah, he used the prophet Isaiah. When God wanted to anoint David as king, he used prophet Samuel. When God wanted to anoint, oh my God, Elisha, he used Elijah. When God wanted to anoint, uh, is it, oh my God, Joshua, he used Moses. God, God speak through man. All blessing come from God through men to men. So a man, your fellow man that you're seeing here on earth, that is the image of God and it's an angel God can use to speak to you. Therefore, if you are watching me, do not look at my size or the echo or my grammar or you came to pick one or two things. Listen to me. Focus on to the Lord. David says, I shall look up to the hills. The moment you look up to the hills and you limit your mindset on that hills, you are going to see a mountain. But the moment you look and lift up your mind to the Lord, he said, I will look up to the hills where my help coming from. My help coming from the Lord. He who make the heaven and the earth. Praise Master Jesus. The Lord told me to, 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 to speak to someone that he has released that bag. Praise Master Jesus. Oh my God. Bag is like a bucket. A bag is like a container. A bag is something that can contain things. I saw a white bag. And the Lord says the white bag stands for purity. That is about to contain new things. The Lord says he is sending a new bag. A new container this new vessel to you because new things are about to begin to happen the Lord said the reason why he is sending you this new bag is because new things are happening will start happening for you I don't know what you have been expecting and believing God just believe me the container is there if you go to the stream without having a container or a bucket you are unable to fetch water but the moment listen to me you go with your bucket or your container that is that is the vessel that will contain the water and it depends the size and the, and, and uh, the size of the container but God says no all type of bag not bag that are coming to give you pain but bag of purity of a new beginning God said he is doing a, a new thing for you the Bible says in the book of, of, of Isaiah he said behold I'm making a new thing for you behold I'm making a new thing 
He said, rivers shall come up from your desert and I will make a way for you in the wilderness. There are people here watching me. Their life has been in pain. Their life has been in one way or the other. Some has been crying. Some have been asking themselves questions. Father, what am I going to do? How long will I be in this pain? How long will I be passing through hell? A lot of us are complaining. We are asking ourselves questions. But believe me, child of God, in the name that is above every other name, I bring you the fresh word of God. And I speak to someone watching and connecting under the sound of my voice. That get ready for your season because the Lord is doing a new thing. The container that you have been waiting has arrived. The content that you have been waiting has arrived. The reason why your marriage has delayed because God was waiting waiting for that container. The reason why your job has not landed because God was still preparing your container. Finally, your container has landed that will contain that particular thing. What are your expectations? Listen to me. I stand as a prophet of God in agreement with this prophetic word. I prophesy in the life of somebody watching and connecting under the sound of my voice. Whatever thing that you have been asking from God, begin to receive it now. The Bible says, Upon Mount Zion, there shall be deliverance, there shall be holiness. And the house of somebody, you are going to put your name. Oh, if your name is Basil, if your name is Emmanuel, ah, just write it, at, just type it at the comment section. And the house of Basil shall possess his possession or their possession. Type it at the comment section. Say, my house shall possess their possession. Type your name and say, my house. Type your name. My house, Basil, possess your possession. I release this prophetic video over the life of somebody. You are possessing your possession. You are possessing your possession in the name of Jesus. God bless each and everyone. For in Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen.